Hello students, I am in San Francisco. There's a beautiful arcade where they restored a bunch of old vintage games from like the turn of the century, 1900, which is the age of imperialism, which is what we're studying. It's a really good example, you know, you can see the, the mechanization from the Industrial Revolution turned into entertainment for your working class people. And it really isn't that expensive to play these games. But you could also really get a good sense of the attitudes of the time and the games that people played and enjoyed. For example, Opium Den. All you'd have to do is put in a coin and you can have a scene played out in front of you. So I'm gonna do that for you. So this is what I, I think one of my students asked. Okay, what was the attitudes of Westerners? Like how did they feel about what was going on in China with Opium? And here's a good characterization of it. I mean, they saw this as entertainment. <laughs> the period. Very interesting piece. You know, I take your girlfriend or boyfriend out to the arcade and you get to see the opium den. And you know, this is the attitudes people had of China at the time in the States. It's interesting to see this blend of industrial revolution and imperialism, which characterizes the culture of the turn of the century. All right. That's all.